Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Before we do begin today's video, make sure you guys are going down below and smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you drop an early like as well. But in today's video, I'm using the MP5 on Cold War. I cannot wait for the beta to be released. But without further ado, we're going to hop straight into the video right now. Hop into the live com. I hope you guys enjoy. Okay guys, welcome back to some more Black Ops Cold War Alpha gameplay. In today's video, we're playing Satellite. We have joined a little bit late and we are using the MP5. Literally my first game with the MP5. I made a little quick class up, which is pretty decent. And there's our first kill. I have been primarily using the AK-74 you. Oh my god, you're going to get turned on. Well, not really, but I knew he was behind me. Uh, you're primarily using the AK-74 you, and I wanted to give the MP5 a try. There's a load of kids on the dooms. Oh my god, this MP5 is feeling nice. I'm liking it so far. Nice. Literally no recoil on this thing. This kid got Oh my god, this thing is a beast. This MP... Oh my god, you got to my left. You're going to get shit on. Oh my days. This MP5 is may, might even be better than the AK-74U, I don't even know. But honestly, I'm so hyped for the full release of this game. I literally cannot wait for Cold War, get something new. This kid's going to go around this little edge of the rock here. He's going to run straight into me, I think. Is he? Is he? What's he doing? Oh, he's turned back around. Let's check. Oh my god, he's not. Oh my days, that kid nearly got me. Literally, I'm so weak. Oh my days, that kid's going to kill. I was literally so weak. I love how you can see your health bar in the bottom left. Uh, just like on Black Ops 4, it really is good just to know how weak you actually are before, you know, re-challenging something or, you know, you never know what you're going to do. So it is nice to know how much health you actually do have in this game. That is a really, really big plus. But I'm interested to see, even in the beta, when the beta does drop on the 8th of October, if you guys are wondering, uh, if it's going to be a lot different to the alpha, I doubt it will really be different at all. There might be a few minor tweaks. It's going to be interesting to see what the I have actually changed. And then after the beta, what will the full game actually be like? The alpha for me feels absolutely perfect. I've not really managed to find a fault. The only issue I've been having, and I know it's not my controller. It, I think it's a glitch in the game. I don't know if you guys have experienced this. Oh my god, I hate that little head glitch on the rock there. I can never see them. Uh, but... When I'm in the menus, like this uh, finder game menus, uh, my it doesn't seem to let me select it. It's like my controller is bugging out and it's just flickering all over the screen. But I know it's not my controller because when I hop into like a create a class menu, it's just fine. Like it would work normally and it obviously doesn't do this on Modern Warfare or any other game for that matter. It's such a weird glitch so hopefully they've picked up on that one and that one has been fixed. Obviously I know it will be by the full game but for the beta I hope it's been fixed because it was so annoying trying to find a game when I wanted to play the Mosh Pit playlist and it won't let me, you know, it won't let me select the 12v12 for some weird reason like my controller. It's like my controller is broke but it's not broke. Oh my god I didn't mean to switch the pistol. Oh my god the hip fire on this thing is nasty. Have I got Merc 4 grip on? Oh my days. But I am loving this MP5 right now. It feels super duper nice. I'm using the proximity mine as my specialist. Just trying it out. I think it's kind of weird how proximity mine is a specialist. But I don't mind that whatsoever because proximity mines are super annoying. It's not something I would usually use in pubs or anything or any game mode for that matter. Uh, you know, I don't really see the point. It has actually triggered and killed someone with, but they have flat jackets. So I didn't actually manage to get the kill. That said, I swear I said I did 133 damage on that kid. Oh yeah, because obviously this is 150 health, not 100 like Modern Warfare. You know, big brain moves there. <laughs> totally forgot. Oh my god, people literally camp so hard on this little right hand side there. I keep just waiting for me. We're 16 and 5 right now. We're having a very decent game. I've heard a lot of people as well complaining about the skill based matchmaking. Uh, it hasn't seemed to have affected my account just yet. I don't know if that's because I didn't play too much on the first day uh, and it's still waiting to you know gauge how good I am at the game or something. I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I really don't know. Uh, but I've seen Skump's video uh, covering skill based matchmaking and I couldn't agree with him more. He literally hit the nail on the head. But this is actually surprisingly a very, very slow paced game. There's literally two minutes left and we're not even halfway through this team deathmatch game, which is interesting. And I only. Oh, it's kill confirmed game sorry uh, but I only seem to be getting team deathmatch or kill confirmed in the mosh pit playlist I'm not getting any decent game moves like dom or hardpoint which I'm getting kind of frustrated at to, for, to be honest I want to play a good game mode not a boring one even though it's not boring because obviously it's a new game but it's not as fun as playing dom or hardpoint or it doesn't last as long should I say as well which obviously does add to the fact that obviously when it doesn't last very long there's not potential to get many kills streaks or anything you know oh my god thank you so much for that kill oh my god I've thrown a stun at him. Never mind. Oh my god, there's one more. Need to reload. Please. There we go. We're going to kill all three of those players. There's two people over here by the sounds of things. I love how the uh, radar. Oh my god, I've just thrown a frag at myself. 
you know, we're not throwing stupid C4s this year. It's going to be stupid frags. We are on a little bit of a streak. Not too much. Oh, my God. Please. Oh, my days. How did I not kill that kid? I don't know what uh, SMG that kid's using. I'm seeing a lot of people using it. It seems super overpowered, but I've not actually used it. And that kid just shot my proximity mine as I threw it. Oh, my God. What are the chances? And there's two people behind me. That's one. We have an attack helicopter. That's two. That This is a very, very good gun. I really do like the MP5. It could be just as good as the AK-74U, if not better. Which I'm surprised at, because the AK-74U is an absolute beast. I didn't expect it to be this great. In fact, I expected it to be pretty awful, because having the MP5 as a top-tier weapon in two games in a row is very slim to have, I do believe. Uh, obviously, it's the beta, so things could change. I'd love to see, you know, more what other things will be unlocking in the beta as well, and how the ranking system is going to work. Supposedly, you could actually rank up in the alpha. It just didn't have a number. Your icon just changed, which was very interesting to know. And I don't know if this was photoshopped or not not but I've seen a couple things on Twitter of people actually hitting prestige and the prestige one icon was actually the same one from Black Ops 4 which is very interesting uh, I'm not sure if it was a photoshopped image or not because I don't know why they would reuse the same prestige icon but you know it's, it's interesting to know nice to see that obviously that might have been possible because usually in a beta we only have a level cap so it'd be strange having the alpha where you could go all the way to prestige but that's just my opinion I just thought the icons was randomized to be honest but, I mean, it is what it is. Kind of uh, strange. 30 and 12 we won that game, so a very decent game. But, unfortunately, guys, this is going to be the end of the video. I hope you guys did enjoy this gameplay. The MP5 is a beast. I can't wait for the beta for Cold War. Honestly, I'll be grinding that so hard. Pumping out so much content, as always, guys. So, make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you're dropping a like as well. Make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. Links for them are in the description below. But, apart from that, guys, thank you guys ever so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one.